Hi, I'm Tim Ambrose. Welcome to the Selco Cricket School. Today I'm going to teach you how to play a bouncer or a short ball. There's two main ways to play a short ball. Uh, one is to avoid the ball, either duck or sway and get out of the way. The other is to play the ball, play a hook shot. For the first one, the most important thing, obviously, is to keep your eye on the ball. That's the number one rule. It's important to have your balance, pick the length of the ball upright early, and then make sure whether you're going to duck or you're going to sway out the way. It, like everything else, it requires practice. A uh, good drill to do is to get, you know, put your helmet on, get one of your mates with some tennis balls, throw it at your head from close, and see how many balls you can get out of the way of. You'd be surprised. It sort of sharpens your reflexes and teaches you how to get out of the way if you get yourself in a little bit of trouble. The second way, which is probably more fun, but requires a bit of practice and a bit of skill, is to play the hook shot. So it's important to, again, to have your balance. Number one rule, watch the ball, never take your eye off the ball, that's when you get yourself in trouble. Uh, so watch the ball, make sure you get your hands nice and high, and then the instinct is to lean back when you're playing a hook shot. That's the last thing you want to do, really. You want to practice it so that your balance is almost coming forward if you can. So you're nice and still and above the ball. If you start to lean back, you lose control, hit the ball straight up in the air, you're out, it's no fun at all. So it's important to practice your balance, making sure you can try and get back into the ball if you can, trying to get your weight as far forward as possible, and then you can decide whether you want to hit the ball down or you want to hit it over the ropes for six.